Hey guys, Mom Vernon Kid here, back again on the Geek Hard Lord at your service. Uh, so you hit that play button, you're going to get your entertainment worth. So, back again, Supergirl has returned. The shows are starting to come back now after their hiatus. Uh, and we're here on the ninth episode of Season 2 of Supergirl, entitled Supergirl Lives. Uh, this episode was actually directed by Kevin Smith. And uh, in this episode, we are seeing a lot of things come to fruition, as well as some things that we already seen happen. Uh, in this episode, Supergirl is transported to another world, and on this world, it is nothing but a red sun. So we all know what happens when Kryptonians around red sun, they become as vulnerable as on the bus. Uh, it all started because of missing Chill, missing people. Uh, people have gone missing, and we are trying. They're trying to figure out what has happened to it. Uh, also, in the meantime, we also see Wynn has a big, big near-death experience while working with Guardian, aka uh, Jimmy Olsen, and uh, he's nearly killed. Uh, and that kind of plays the head games with him, you know, of being afraid and. You know, quitting. He's he wanted to quit. He didn't want to work anymore in the field. Um, and then you have Monel still trying to find his way in himself as well. Uh, he's bartendering now at the the bar that you know is full of aliens. Um, and of course, then he is he and Kara are captured by none other than Roulette. Roulette is in this episode, and she is helping these alien race uh, smuggle human trafficking, selling slaves all over the galaxy. Just shows you how fucked up Roulette really is. She don't care. Uh, there's also the, the sense of, also with, um, with Alex, you know, is, you know, with her and and Molly, you know, basically is, are they cool? You know, she feels that, you know, as soon as happiness starts coming to her, something pulls, is, she's always fighting against happiness, or happiness is, something is always fighting for her to be happy, and it kind of plays off that. Uh, but the, the concept of this episode was pretty good. Um, nothing really too big besides the big, uh, reveal of a familiar face we've seen before in this episode, uh, Alien Race. I think you guys should know who I'm talking about. Uh, but also, the fact is is that the people that are trying to get mon are on their way. Uh, Alex comes to grips of what is going on, as well as the fact that Maggie easily discovers that Kara's is Supergirl. You know, I thought that was pretty obvious, and I was glad they brought that up. She was like, you know, yeah, that your sister's Supergirl, I get it. You know, the glasses don't do much. Thank you, <laughs> you know. Uh, but, uh, yeah, this episode was okay. Uh, nothing really big besides the fact that Monel also has decided to uh, take up the role of Becoming a hero, so we may see Monel in his classic costume or some sort of ver variation of it. You know, the red and the blue cape and things like that. Uh, the bad guys are still; his people are still on their way to capture, get him. Um, now they know where he is. And uh, when, after s stepping up, when he was off off Earth, he's realized that you know. I'm ready to get back in the game and help Jimmy while he does his thing here. So, uh, like I said, um, nothing bad about this. Like I said, this was Kevin Smith's direct. Uh, uh, this was he was. This was directed by Kevin Smith. Um, it was good, but I I think it's it didn't really soar as much as I thought it was gonna be. You know, uh, especially when I heard of the title Super Supergirl Lives. Uh, but I can't wait to next week's episode because Live Wire is back, so I'm looking forward to that. Uh, but yeah, not bad, not a bad episode. Uh, you guys tell me in the comment section below, as always, 
What did you think about this episode, The Return of Supergirl? Did you watch it? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Uh, this is Mom Running Kids saying peace with love. Stay tuned. Keep it real, guys. I'll catch you guys next week with another review, recap of Supergirl. Y'all take care.